What's going on guys? Today we are playing Portal Stories Mel. Uh, I forgot this came out and I uh, was shifting through my game list the other day and thought I'd give it a try. So let's do it. I don't know about you but this is the closest thing to Portal 3 we will ever come to and we're gonna go give it a shot. Hopefully it's good from what the... it's been quite good for its own kind of sequel. Load already. They kill me. Again, 10 frames. It's amazing. Oh, wait, wait. We're getting 60. Never mind. Chapter 1952. Alright. I guess it's chapter 1, not chapter 1952, but. It's Oh, okay. <clears throat> Greetings, People. astronaut, Holy crap. hero, or Olympian. My name's Cave Johnson, and boy, do I have something to show you. Cave Johnson, we're done you're here. here because you're the best the world has to offer. I don't say that lightly, mind you, so take that as one of the biggest compliments you'll ever get in your life, even if you don't know who I am. In the beginning, I started a shower curtain company, making asbestos-laden shower curtains for the military, but I kept Ooh. dreaming bigger and better. Big shower curtains. And you know what? That dreaming became doing. Lots of doing. Lots of Which doing. You here. Do things. You're riding into the little Michigan town of. Uh, wait. Where are we again? Yeah, where the hell are we? Good question. Uh, okay. So, this town doesn't have a name yet, as we're the ones who got here. But that doesn't mm, matter. Gummy. Point is, you're riding there, and you'll soon be. At Aperture Science Innovators. Oh, this can't be good. We're, We're still getting some of this stuff together, but there's a lot of science we can do in the meantime. You've been selected from a large group of candidates for a special test in our temporary testing areas. Do all the when science. When the train arrives at the station, head into the town and into the Aperture building. No worry, Hopefully this is not very is. loud. Um, if it is, messages once you're there. I don't know Get what to tell you. To some science. For now, though, we're going to put on some nice music for you. Enjoy yeah. the ride. Music! This is horrible. No? No? I feel like you should be able to do something in this, this train. I don't know. Testing area. Testing. Testing, please. Alright, you're now arriving at Aperture Central Station. That can't be good. Wait. Chris, go ahead. How do you spell station? Okay, think about that for a second. Okay. Does station have an extra O before the I? I before E, except after... After things? Oh, wait. Because you're fired! Get out of my office. Out. Get out. Out of my office. Okay, then. Oh, I can't re record this. <clears throat> Wait, we have reached our destination, it looks like. Where's my door? Door. Blackness to a door. And a mouse! I don't think you guys see my mouse. Oh, spooky. Okay. Well, we gotta explore. Now, as I said before, there's a lot we're still working on. Just watch your step on the way out, and as a reminder, Aperture Science Innovators is not responsible for any injury you sustain, up to and including death by exposure to cosmic ray spallation. Don't worry, though. We haven't had an accident like that in three days. Uh, Achievable. Sorry. All right. Make that three minutes. Three minutes. Here at Aperture uh, Science Innovators, we love to give back to the community. We? So, instead of just giving back, we made our own community. Entirely made out of Aperture Science malleable concrete on top of the salt mines. And that's exactly why you shouldn't touch the walls or stomp your feet either. <clears throat> that's thing we need is to touch up the dents in the wall because someone was too hands on. Yep, okay then. Well. I'm gonna guess the doors. 
I told you it was easy to find. You found it faster than uh, any test subjects on record. <clears throat> that's not right. Uh, that's not good. We're gonna be here a while. Just head through the door on the right to the elevator. You don't nope. know where to go. No, no, no. Let me through this door. There's no big guard in it. Help. I need an adult. Creepy. So, at first, I wanted to put in a long flight of stairs that spiraled down through the old salt mines down here. Give the test subjects a great view of the place. But no! The zoning boards on my bean counter said that's why they invented elevators. Yes. So, when someone in a wheelchair threatened to sue, my former boys chicken out of me and built this elevator to go to our temporary offices. I'm still working on those stairs, and those guys are working on getting new jobs. <laughs> you go, Kid Seriously, Johnson. The stairs you go. Ready, so get on that stupid elevator. Come on, let's go. I, I can't get out, so... Okay, the last... Not feeling this. Um, okay. It's not like we need a lot of backstory. The boundaries of science that little bit more. That's why we're taking on this new project. When the bean counters told me not to buy a salt mine to do all this science, the first thing they said was, No, there's too much space. You can't suspend something over nothing and pray that a test can happen in thin air. Well, thanks to some use of the old calculator between the ears and a generous helping of the you're fired stamp, I came up with a final solution to that. If you can't anchor something in thin air, why bother trying to make it in the air in the first place? Oh. I came up with this. Thoughts? What would you come up with? Where are we? Introducing the Aperture Science Innovators Suspended Testing Sphere. Each sphere is suspended in the air, anchored to the walls by concrete and steel lattice rebar. They seem like they float in the air, but in fact, they don't. Plus, we can keep building above them. Onward and upward. This okay. line here can take at least ten of these bad boys per shaft. Nine shafts, ninety tests. We can test whatever we want to and beat that other company into the ground. Woo! What like other company? Oh. These guys will kiss my. <laughs> anyway, the bean counters yep. like babies when they saw the cost of these things. things. But they went their pants when they threw them out the door. I pay the bills. I make the decisions around here. And I hire <laughs> and fire as I please. <clears throat> now. The first of these spheres won't be ready for a few more months, so Me you'll be participating in one tests. of our smaller tests, the Aperture Science Innovator's Short-Term Relaxation Vault. Maybe not so much. I don't know, what do you guys think so far? It definitely has the portal feel. Uh, a little bit too much talky-talky. Not, uh, not digging Cave Johnson's voice either. However, I'm sure you can't just copy-paste. Although we would all like to. Cave Johnson, we're done here. Priceless. It's actually my freaking ringtone. If any of you are actually wondering, probably not. But now you know. For science. When you get to the offices, I'll tell you a bit more. This test should be real easy for you, though. Just get inside one of the Aperture Science Innovator's short-term relaxation vaults and lie in a bed. You'll feel yourself fall asleep quickly. Don't worry, though. Our science boys will get you out shortly. You'll only be out for a few minutes. Uh, an hour, at most, if something goes wrong. Yeah, <laughs> you boy. We ain't got everything under control. You'll be making science, and you won't have to do a thing. Who's the winner here? You are. <laughs> well, at least his commentary's on spot. But this, this is annoying. Like, we do not need all this. Just put me at the bottom here already. I get it. Big hole. We're here. We're not here. Hole? Wait. Wait. This could be good. Bingo! Loading screen. Check in game 48. You figured the math. Woo! Okay. So, as I said on the last pre-recorded message, you'll be heading into an Aperture Science Innovator's short-term relaxation vault for a quick, deep sleep, and then you're done. That's why we brought you here at night. You're most likely a walking zombie. That'll give us the best results. 
Zombie. Don't sleep too long. This isn't a bed and breakfast. And if you decide to stay tonight, I'm charging your rent for the next year. That's actually... Oh, okay. Well... the. But hey, achievement. Look at that. Testing the waters. So, as I said on the last pre-recorded message, you'll be heading to an Aperture Science Innovators short-term relaxation vault for Oh my god, I heard you the first time. And then you're done. That's why we brought you here at night. You're most likely a walking zombie. That'll give us the best results. Alright, Don't stay so. too long. This isn't a bed and breakfast. And if you decide to stay tonight, I'm charging you rent for the next year. We'll have a bed ready for you. Just follow the testing area signs and go to bed. Don't mind the turrets. Turrets. They're firing blanks. At least that's what Crazy Harry told me. <clears throat> Got six signs, boy, just disappeared because of him. The hell's in here? Gimme, gimme. Caution, where your respirator? I don't think so. Science, it's taking risks. It's business. Alright. So obviously we're exploring. We, uh... Hardly working. I write that. I require uh, just my boss. Okay. Okay. Layoffs. Anyone? Hmm. Indeed. A typewriter. What the hell am I looking at here? Hey, I went inside that door. Gimme. Oh. 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 Nope. Nope. I ain't, ain't happening. What's up here? Alright. Well. I guess let's get moving. Not that way. Can we go this way? Can we go down this way? Can we jump? We can jump. No fall damage. How about that? Oh, it's like Cape Johnson. Don't worry, those toys won't kill you. The safety on their guns is on. Had some lab boys shut them down. Well, death. That was... Random, I never even saw them, actually. I don't want to go in the hole. If you're hearing this message, you're at the saving chamber. Carolyn, is it that's ready? Carolyn. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. Oh, that's not Carolyn. Then you're good to go. Step into the chamber and get into the bed. Our lab boys will take care of the rest. Good old. All right, come on, come on. Sleepy, sleepy. Good night. I'm so sleepy. Well, this has been pretty uneventful so far, and quite boring. Oh, this can't be good. Alright. Any day now. What? Wow. Is the... Is, <laughs> you is the thing on? No, I'm recording an episode. Hello? Can you hear me? <laughs> I'm playing oh, some, yes. uh, Portal 2, uh... <laughs> so sorry. Or Portal Blinken, Stories, Mel. Or War Hero. There was, uh, a yeah. slight problem with the test. Don't worry, though. I realized that I still had this uh, in my games Nothing's list changed. and never played Just, it, so uh, out of the chamber. I'll we thought it'd be a great time there. to do it. Although, the freaking... holy crap. Freaking <laughs> intro to this game took forever. Don't worry about the heights. Had a few of my scientists make what's called long Were you able to get into our... I mean, Oh, I haven't even tried yet. Long fall okay. Boots. You should let me know. Well, I had the, uh, it's on my list, and I'm loading Primal Game Data now, so... Yeah, alright then. Well, we might end this here then, because... Well, I haven't very got, gotten very far with this. 
here ruining your uh, portal videos. Yay! No, I mean, they're, I, I spent the last 15 minutes going through nothing but uh, little skits of Cave Johnson. Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna guess I have to go that way, don't I? Well, screw it. We'll end here. All right, guys. Wait for the next episode of when uh, I walk into this turret and everything goes to hell. <laughs> Later.